witnessed a shootout inside a local mom and pop pharmacy. The chaotic scene and the clerk who fought back. Your news at five starts now. And we start with that shootout inside a pharmacy tonight. Two suspects behind bars accused of trying to rob Doug's El Dorado drugstore in Stockton. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Sharon Roger. And I'm Tony Lopez. This isn't the first time shots have been fired inside this pharmacy on Mariposa Road. CBS 13's Yasmin Hassan is live for us there tonight with more on this developing story, Yasmin. That's right. I actually just got an update from police within the last few minutes. They think that these two 18-year-olds are responsible for terrorizing robbery, uh, pharmacies rather, all over the area. I heard gunshots. Boom, 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 boom. Police just telling us these two men have been robbing pharmacies in the Stockton area. You can see their guns drawn, faces covered, terrorizing workers. So one employee at Doug's El Dorado Drugs was prepared in case they came into his pharmacy. And yesterday, that's exactly what happened. They want everything. Give us everything. It was just chaotic. It was awful. Police say when the two men came storming in, that employee started shooting and they fired back. If he wouldn't have stopped it right then and there, no telling what would have happened. A terrifying takeover that one employee has now lived through twice. I heard everybody down, and I was trying to, like, where do I go? Back in 2012, two armed men came into this same pharmacy, and the same thing happened. An employee was armed and started shooting. All of a sudden, I just kind of, like, felt something take over my body. Like that, maybe the adrenaline. A customer was hit in the crossfire that time. Yesterday, no one was hurt. But employees know it could have ended differently. They could have shot any one of us. Now, two arrests have been made, but police are still looking for a third suspect. And they're also looking for a vehicle. It is a 2000 or a 1999 four-door white Mercedes Benz. Obviously, anyone within any information is asked to contact police. Yeah, what a wild scene. Mm -hmm. All right, Yasmin, live in Stockton. Thank you.